Hello, Scorpio. How are you? Thank you for joining me. Thank you for sharing your energy with me. This is a general reading for your Scorpio placements for the week for whatever is listed because at this time, I really have no clue. All right, we got the first two out. Woo-hoo. Look, well, let's see what that is about because that is very interesting. All right, Scorpio, if you don't mind, hit that like button. Let Raton know that you think he's cute. His He's been a little depressed lately, so he could really use it. <laughs> right, baby? Yes. I will not be going live until further notice, guys. Not by choice, but by necessity. Please bear with me. Don't think I don't miss you because you know I do. Until then, we're just going to focus on getting your readings out. My God, you're... you're popping your cards are popping yes i do pre-shuffle but uh still it usually takes a little bit more than that to get it done but not for you no 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 i think you know what you want i think you're going after it i think that you are allowing and being and doing and seeing okay it's not going to be the easiest no it is not okay so your first card out is Merkaba, movement, long distance travel and excitement. You might be moving along with the fire element, warrior passion and fearlessness, going after what you truly want, sacrificing, giving in to movement is what I'm getting surrendering to the movement all right dragon rider holy crap talk about fire energy you are riding the beast merlin you are taking control oh you got three here okay rainbow blessings blessings are showering your life that's amazing you are seeing the horizon in the flow everything is smooth sailing Love this. Stepping into power. You are strong beyond measure. You're taking a step forward and not sure that you can do it, but you're doing it anyway. Choices. You're making the choice to empower yourself this week. Number 46 and number 35. Strength. Again, being bold, being fearless, doing it anyway, right? I don't know what you're up to, but I like it. I like it. I do. You could be moving. You could be traveling. You could be going on vacation. Don't think you're going on vacation. You could be traveling, though. Okay, you are the magician. You are Merlin. You are riding that dragon. When you ride that dragon, that means that you are deciding to take control of the beast. Now, the beast, what can that be? That can be your circumstances. It can be your lower self. It can be, ah, yep, pretty much those two things. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, don't force it. Don't force it. Don't force it. Let it go. Let it slide into place. Oh, everything's going to slide into place, love. Okay. King of Cups, Eight of Wands, Two of Wands, and the Queen of Wands. What did I say about fire? Fire. Okay, here you are. First card out. Love this. You are large and in charge. Oh, God, again, yes, again, the choice is yours, Things, choices are being made, things are moving forward, communication is coming in and a path is being chosen, and here you are yet again, Queen of Wands. You are in charge of your emotions, you are steady, You, Scorpio, I don't know what happened, but this is flipping phenomenal. The energy sh that has shifted, it's got to be your mind. It's not exterior shifts. It's internal shifts. Understand that, love. Your life is getting on the right track because of an internal shift. Okay? Ooh, there you are. Holy crap. Oh, my gosh. Okay. We're going to clarify these as well. So then you have the Emperor, the Knight of Cups, and the Three of Swords. The Emperor is taking charge of communication, taking charge of your forward movement. Knight of Cups with the Eight of Wands and the Two of Wands. You are moving along your path. Mm -hmm. Now, this path 
that you are moving along, you are having to leave something in the past. You are having to leave something behind. Is that something you necessarily want to do? No, but you're not really seeing a choice in the matter. The devil with death, because things have to change. Things have to change. It's no longer okay. No longer acceptable. No longer okay. All right. All right, so we're going to go over these. Here you are. You're balanced out emotionally. Queen of Pentacles. I think Libra just had this combination. I believe so. You, you're, you're, you're getting downloads. You're protecting your, oh, okay. You're protecting yourself by, by your own emotional stability. Listen to me. By your being emotionally stable, you are protecting yourself from outside influences that are not the most positive. And because you are doing that, you are quickly moving forward creating the empress what does she do she creates she is abundant because she is always planting seeds she knows when to plant and when to harvest and where to plant right this empress if you notice yes it's the mermaid cards but she's half in the water and half out so she's she's really balanced Again, like the King of Cups, but she creates. Okay, so you are moving forward, creating, choosing a path, and actually going down it. That's flipping amazing. A pathway opens up to you, and you are taking it, taking it, taking it. Queen of Wands with the Four of Pentacles. Well, you look good, okay? Can we just put that out there? The Empress with the Queen of Wands. Yeah, you're looking smart. You're taking care of yourself. You are. Oh, look at you go. You're taking care of yourself. You're going after what you want and you're doing what you need to do to get what you want to get. But your self-love is on spot this week. Love that. Okay. And then we go over to here. We have the emperor with the eight of swords. What nobody knows is you are stuck in your head. How am I going to do this? Everything is under control, but how am I going to freaking manifest this? How is this going to happen? How is it going to play out? I will tell you how it's going to play out. With you moving forward with your heart on your sleeve, okay, Because but you're still protected. He's still fully armored. Balancing. Making everyone believe everything is perfect. Look at you. Because that, that rabbit balancing those pentacles there, that seems like a magic trick. Ooh, you're magical. Everything you're turning, you're touching this week turns to gold. Three of swords with the ten of wands. You are handling disappointments like a champ. There are roadblocks. There are bumps. There are speed bumps, speed tables, whatever you want to call them, along your path. That's where the strength, you got two strength cards in a row, okay? Along with the dragon rider, that's the emperor. No, 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 love. Do not get discouraged. Do not get discouraged. I need another card on that. Okay. So, then we come down to the devil, the hermit, and the queen of swords. <gasps> Ooh, so powerful. Look at you. Holy crap. Going within, taming, again, with the taming of the lower, right? The lower emotions. You are taming everything down. You are seeing the devil in the details. You are seeing the devil in your own um, actions and thoughts, and you are cutting it out. Yes, you're seeing where you're self-sabotaging, and you are saying, no, we're done with that. We're not going to do that anymore. And then we have you with the Knight of Swords. You're not going to tolerate such negative thinking or behavior, not only from others, but from yourself. Also, somebody's spying on you. 
just saying. Okay, and then we go to strength and 10 of cups as to why you're doing it. Why you're doing it? Because you have the ability, strength card yet again, mm -hmm, with the 10 of cups. You know what you want. You know what you're going after. And you're going to manifest it. Come hell or high water, you are. Seven of swords, wheel of fortune, the sun, and the two of swords. It's time for you to make plans. It is time for you to be gentle with yourself as well as others. There is a tricky situation in which you're going to have to handle with kick gloves, okay? And then we have the sun with the two of swords. Communication, choices. You're going to have more choices because of your even balanced emotions, okay? Because you're taking charge, it's going to be giving you another choice. And this choice is not going to be difficult. It's not. Would you like to know why I say that? Because on this Two of Swords, let's see if we can get it. Hold on. Ring lights are wonderful, but they glare on the cards. Okay. They're both smiling. They're both smiling. They're not playing, but they're playing. Do you know what I mean? And the Sun card. You're playing for keeps, but it's not a serious battle. Do you know what I mean? You're not taking things too seriously because you're seeing light at the end of the tunnel. This is amazing. I absolutely love this for you, Scorpio. I absolutely love this. This was clear and to the point. Don't let hiccups disturb your peace. You have choices to make. You are walking down a new path. Don't let hiccups disturb your peace. Okay? Three of swords, ten of wands. That's, that's hiccups in the road. Don't let that get you distracted, okay? All right, let's get an advice card for you. Remember, like, share, subscribe, leave a comment down below, hit that like button, I don't get, you know, you, you know the drill, you know the drill, you watch enough tarot, you hear enough people say it, you know, okay, once we get to 4,000 subscribers, I will be giving away three free 20 minute readings, so stay tuned for that, because we're getting close, yay, all right, the counselor, He's funky. He's got wings. He's got horns. He's underwater. The counselor. And he is water. Number 12, 10, 11, queen, 12. Okay. All right, this is your advice from spirit for the week. Empathetic, wise, objective advice, trustworthy, emotional, understand, oh, I'm sorry, emotional understanding, big difference, clarity and sharing. A time of questions and mixed emotions. Look beyond the words to the emotions. Mixed or confused emotions. Listen listen and hear. Seek objective counsel, an emotionally complex situation, a lack of empathy, an opportunity for understanding. Be receptive, not rejecting. Are feelings preventing a resolution? So you guarding your emotions over here Hmm, interesting. Acknowledge the emotions. Be willing to listen to others. Hear others out this week. Of course, don't judge. And if you have concerns, seek someone, <coughs> excuse me, seek someone that you can discuss this with, okay? You don't have to go this road alone. Hold on. You don't have to do it all alone, all right? 
So you do have someone that you can talk to. It's up to you to actually open up love. All right, guys, that's all I have for you for now. You know that I love you. Peace to you. Ciao.